and welcome to DC Tech Talks. So in this video today, we are going to learn how to use the Bartender software, which is a barcode printing software, which comes along with your barcode printer. In this case, Decode DC 420 Pro Series. So once we open the software, we will have to click on this new tab because we want to design a new label, a blank label. So once we click on that, we'll have to keep this blank template checked. Do we want to specify any custom range? No. We want to design a single label. Yes. If we have some wastage around, then we'll click yes. We have rounded edges. Yes. And we are trying to design a 100 mm wide and a 50 mm high barcode. So the width would be 100 mm and the height would be 50 mm right so this is the size and then the orientation we can select portrait if we have a landscape then we can design landscape if you want to rotate it 180 degree or uh, portrait and landscape we can do that as well then once we click next and then once we finish we'll have a blank template right in front of us so if we want to design a label then we have several options available in this particular software this is the barcode tab, this is the text tab, this is line tab. If we want to insert any kind of line, if we want to insert any kind of shapes, this is the tab for that. So under text, if you want to add a single line, then single. If you want to add a paragraph, then we'll have to select a multi line. So this is the text sample text. So once we click on that, we can select any kind of font which we, we might want. And then the font size, bold, italics or underline, whatever formatting you might want with your text. If you want to align your text in center from left to right or from top to bottom, or you can freely float your sample text as well. So this gives you complete freedom. And then we might want to enter a barcode as well. So in this case, we'll select a simple 1D, code 128. So this is a 1D barcode which we have inserted. Now, once we double click on that and select data source, and then you can type in whatever data you might want your barcode to contain. In this case, we'll simply write the model number of this particular barcode printer, which is Decode 421 Pro. So here it is right in front of you. And then let's enter one 2D uh, barcode, which is a QR code in this case. So let's enter one QR code. And again, in data source, you can select whatever data you might want your uh, QR code to contain right so but just in case you don't want this one two three four five six seven eight of human readable you just click on human readable select none and then close it so this barcode contains the same value which is one two three four five six seven eight but this is not human readable you will be only able to see it once you scan the barcode so now let's try and print this label so our system has already selected this particular barcode printer. Now, once we hit print, we have this exact label printed right in front of us. So this is the label. But now if in case we want to print any data in a serialized manner, so let's type in one, two, three, four, five. And again, we'll double click on this particular barcode we'll go to transforms we'll click on serialization so in case you want to print in an increasing order then select increment and de for decreasing order decrement so the increment value would be one right and then we'll simply close it and we'll try and print this particular label once again and we just print for barcode right so there it is five six seven eight and our software already flashes the number nine which is the next barcode from which it will start printing and now let's try and design a format for a two across label which means 
we have one small label on the left and one small label on the right just like this so these are called two across label and these can be designed in this particular bartender software as well and what do you have to do you just click on the page setup and the width would be same you ha just have to go to the layout setting and increase the number of columns which in this case is two and if you happen to have more number of labels across then you can simply increase the number of columns to three four whatever uh, the number of labels are so it is saying that we'll adjust the format according to the new label size we say yes so let's try and adjust the format according to the new label size so this is a 50 by 50 label because we've cut the label format in two i hope you remember that and now let's try and see how the preview looks like so this is the print preview which is also in serialization because we selected serialization for our last label format so let's try and print the labels so now you can see there are two labels across in serialization 49 50 51 and 52 and as you can see on the screen your next label number would be 53 so this completes the basic tutorial for bartender software i hope you like the video thank you so much for watching